Hello and welcome to another episode of Battle Ready. Ready. Let's put the face flicking. <laughs> that is only the first time I've done it. Where today we have the same Seraphon as last time. And they've rezzed themselves. All yes, of them. they're all good. They're all good again. Bastillas, Saurus, Troglodons, Crocs and Gore Skinks, Crocs Cavalry. In the front, all cavalry, the cavalry, Croak. Croak, and a Star Hi, Priest. Hi, guys. But this time, they will be facing New Zinch. And I have spells that hurt your chicken. So, yeah, yeah, that's true. I my chicken is a little in trouble. I put, placed my chicken pretty far back so he'd be out of range of the solar engine. Because the solar engine gets plus one to cast demon slaps. Yeah, it hits demons hard. So we're going to go ahead and keep him back for this first <laughs> round. Uh, we do have our newest model, which is a Fate Master of Zinch hanging out No more Zangor H. Yeah, the Zangor Shaman is no longer as good as it once was. Oh, we Oh, yeah. So, now we uh, we have these. So we're going to be fighting in Won't Back Down. There are six objectives on the board. The territories are the small table lengths. And right? Be back, back down. <laughs> there are six objectives. Standard scoring. The only special rule for this one is that any unit wholly on an objective rallies on a five. And but it's a veterans fight. rally on a four. So we're going to get So there back. might be some rallying going on, especially because I've got a lot of these guys. Oh, uh, Drake, your Croxagors, yeah. yeah, I mean, your Source Warriors and your Skinks are expert conquerors. Do you have um, Bounty Hunters? Uh, these guys and those guys were Bounty Hunters also. Do so you want to keep them as the Bounty Hunters? Yeah. Okay. They were so good as bounty hunters. And then on my end, I have all these guys. All my acolytes are expert conquerors. And then both enlightened, or I guess what? enlightened and skyfires. Those are my uh, conquerors. Bounty hunters. bounty hunters. All right. So we will start this off. I finished dropping first. Yes, by one. And I think I am going to let you go first. Okay. So we will start it off with Seraphon. Yeah. Turn one. All right, let's do this. Okay, here we are. We are going to go ahead and start let's with the Seraphon. Spells, 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 spells. So Drake is going to get one plus one. I'm going to get two plus one. I okay, so let's start us off with heroic actions command and point. battle tactics. And getting command points. All right, so command point. For, uh, I'm going to. I'm doing the ability for more cloak and the star priest. Oh, well, before you do that, decide on your heroic actions because that should really be done first yeah. at the start. Command point. Yay! Um, all right, you've got four, five, six, but I've got one. You have enough to unbind me, I'm sure. All right, I'm gonna try to get a command point as well then. Oh, actually, well, I'll roll this. Okay, I get it. But before we actually give out command points, I have my first ability. And my first ability is... Well, and fate dice. I can auto summon a spell. What? Yep. So I'm gonna auto summon. That doesn't seem. All right, now I know what I'm exploding. Uh, you cannot be dispelled on the first battle round. And that is what I like to call a fate point. Oh, and. You need your roll. I gotta roll my destiny dice. So we're just getting way ahead of ourselves. Way ahead. Shouldn't all this right. all be done on your turn? No, this is actually all pre game. All right, so destiny dice. Oh, snap. Ooh, two sixes, two fives. That's a lot of triple. That's two doubles. Double five. This is a triple Four, and three, two singles. and three ones. That's so I'm not one. super excited about those ones. Maybe they'll be okay for Battle Shock. Unless although I don't two. plan on dying. <laughs> uh, but I plan on squishing you. Yeah, that's too bad. But okay. those sixes and fives will be good. Okay. Command points from Lord Croak. All right. So, no, uh, Battle Tactic. Your Battle Tactic. Uh, I'm going to be going to do against the odds. All right. So, you're going to do against those odds. So, Lord Croak, three dice, four ups. Four ups. Got Come one more. Point. And now one for the Spark Priests. Uh, no. I did not have that good foresight. Uh, Comments call. Okay, okay, so you're doing spells now. Now we do lasers. Yeah, I picked this one so I can get all those guys. Yeah, the only thing I can't reach is the- I so You get Zangors, Zangors, Fate Master, this group, that group. Yeah. That's a lot of guys. All right, which one do you want to do first? Uh, let's go Fate Master. Um, okay. So do I get ability if I'm close? Oh, uh, you're not close enough. All right. So on a four up. Lasers. All right. Uh, okay. I give him D3. Two lasers. All right. He takes two. What does the Fate Master start at? Sad. 
No, he starts at six, so he's down to four. Woo! All right, now do the Skyfires. Okay. No. All right, do the Enlightened. Nah. All right, do the group of 20. Nah. And the group of 10. Nah. Okay, all right. That was, that was gonna be scarier than I thought it was. All right, so that's it for lasers, which takes us to spells. Croak, Comet's Call. Okay. Comet's Call. Five. Well, plus two. one, right? I guess plus two. I guess plus two, so that's seven. I make it. Seven is a make. Seven is a make. All right, I am gonna try to unbind then. I'm gonna unbind with uh, this group of 10, because they have a Volch arc, so that gives them a plus one to their unbind. They all have a Volch arc. So you need a show a seven. Show a seven. Ha! Oh, that was a four. Comet's call. All right, so you got it with a seven, you get D3 units. Yep. Yeah. One. I will pick your chicken. No, I'll pick the that guy. Fate Master again. Yeah. All right, uh, so give him D3. Two. Oh man, this guy. I want. I just want to kill him so you don't get him. Okay, now do Celestial Deliverance with Lord Croak. Okay. Five. That's a seven, because he gets plus two. That's in. All right, I'll try to unbind with, um, am I in range? I'm not in range, because that should have to be within 18. Oh, it's within 10. Within 10, yeah, I'm not even in, okay. within range. that didn't count. Uh, Mystic Shield. Well, we'll just count that as your Mystic Shield roll. Okay. Uh, I'll try to unbind with the Ogroid. No. Nope. And then he will cast Arcane Bolt. Uh, actually. So hold on, you've cast two spells now successfully. Um, any other spells you want to cast? Uh, Give me some fate points. Give Arcane me some fate Bolt. Uh, I'll let you have it. That's a 12. Yeah. Oh, I guess I wouldn't be unbinding. Oh, I could unbind. Oh. And then that's all of the spells we have. All right, who'd you put Mystic Shield and Arcane Bolt on? Well, Arcane Bolt goes on Crow. Yeah. And then Mystic Shield. Mystic Shield will go on my Cruiser. Okay, anybody else that you want to uh, cast spells? You do Oh, I already did it. You already did Comet's Call. Uh, what is the spell he has? Oh, yeah, he had Celestial Harmony. Okay, Celestial Harmony. Uh, if I hit it, you, I pick a unit and they don't get Battle Shock. Okay, so it's on a five, I think. Well, that's a seven, six. Does he get a plus one? I don't know if he does. No. But I'm going to try to unbind with my 20 unit that has a full arc. Got a nine, so you got to <laughs> Okay, sheesh. Uh, and then he's going to do Hand and Glory. Okay. Glorious Hands. He does not have Glorious. Does that make it? Uh, I don't think so. No, went off. Okay. okay. You have four fate points. I have four fate points. This might have been a bad idea. Uh, Movement phase. Is that it? Okay, so at the end of the hero phase, yep, we'll do a quick before and after on movement. This is the before. Okay, we're back. Basically everything shuffled forward. I don't think anything ran. Uh, so that's going to take us to the shoot phase. Yay. So first your Carnosaur, what's the range on his shooting? I think it's 12. 18. Oh yeah, then he's got plenty of range. Uh, my Fate Master has cover, so you're gonna be minus one to hit. Cool. Or okay. Crook. All out attack. Or all out volley, whatever it's called. Okay. Um, I'll go ahead and all out defense him. D6 attacks. Five attacks. Threes. Okay. Fours. Good. That's what I like. Still it on! Okay, who's he shooting into? I will shoot them. Okay. I have nine of them. I... Yeah! Oh, that was good. That was lots of shooting. Good. And uh, three. Uh, one man. One rend, so they go up to a, here they are, fives? Rip. Yeah, fives. So they're, these are six up saves. Oh, oh I made yeah, one. Two damage. And six up ward. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I'm not sure. 
Ah, two die. We blasted these two guys in the back. Okay. That's it. Uh, I don't think you're in range for your fusil of conflagration. What's the range on it? No. All right, just out. So I think that does it for. Sh oh, what's the range of his? He's got a spitting attack. I think it's eighteen. Well, eighteen would be plenty. Yep, Doctor Spittle range is eighteen. Yep. So you can get. You can get the middle guys. Okay. D three. One spittles. One spit. Man, I did not have a lot of sunflower seeds yet. Mm -hmm. And threes. All right. Good. All right, we're done with shooting charge, Miss. I have sure. one eligible charge. He has a 12 inch charge. 12 inch charge. Would you like to reroll it? <laughs> no. Okay. Uh, that's my only elevated way. Okay, then that's it. All right. I get max points. So at the end here, you did complete your battle tactic. You control four objectives. So you are going to get five points. Woo! Come at me, bro. All right. So now we each get a command point for our General. generals. Uh, I am going to try to heal my fate master. No. No! Got it. He heals. One. Yes. I'm going, uh, how many spells can you cast? So seven or eight, depending on if this guy, if he succeeds his first cast, he can cast a second. If he doesn't, he can't. So either seven or eight unbinds. I'll go, he's going to be smart and stop one spell. Okay. So let's go ahead and cast some spells. All right, I'm gonna start with some Gestalt sorceries. So we're gonna start with the group, the unit of 10. Does it cast on a six? I think it does. Would that be bad? Cause you rolled a five. I think it plus one, as long as they have their scroll. It does cast on a six. Mm. Well, I'm stopping it with my trough. Okay. Wait, which unit's casting it? This one. Yeah, we'll go truck. Okay. Okay, it's gone. Okay. I will do the middle unit Gestalt Sorcery. I got it with a 13. I could unbind it with Krog. Nah, you can have it. Okay, so they are Gestalted. And you get a free point. Then the third group is going to do their Gestalt. No. Five. Uh, five doesn't make it. Dang. Yeah. Okay. Mm. So uh, then we're going to go into right, our... Guys, all right. The Ogroid is gonna cast his shield. Uh, was it his shield of fate? No, infusion arcanum. We need the five. You got an eight. All right. Uh, Lord. Plus one to hit and wound if that goes off. Lord Crook. Ah, dang. Thirteen. It. Okay. All right. I've used two on binds. Then the Magister. Actually, I'm going to have my Lord of Change cast an Umbral Spell Portal. What? Well, whatever. Cast on a five. No! Kirk, stop that spell portal. And you show a... Uh... A five. A five is shown! Dang. All right, I'm going to cast... No spell portal for you. The symbol thing. I got an eight. Croak. I need a show with seven. All right, so that will be a fate point, and I will put up my sigil. Um, and then the Magister is going to pick a unit within 18. I guess that's the Croxagores. No, their own units. And he's gonna roll, and this is on a cast on Nate. Got it with a nine. Okay. Uh, man, that was you were pretty good on the shutdowns. Well, I guess we'll go on to the movement phase. So, oh, at the end of the round, I was supposed to check for battle shock in the last round. So the Carrick acolytes have a bravery of five. So I will have foreseen it. Use one of my ones, and on a five up, they uh, I get this this die back. Oh, all right, that one's out. Sweet. So now we will go to the movement phase. And so this is the before. Okay, we are back. So 
everything moved up, and now it is time for the glorious shooting phase. Dun, 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 dun. Glorious shooting phase. Okay. Um, let's start with these bad boys, these Arcanites over here, because I believe their range is 18 inches. So they so should be able to hit those Saurus. 14 of the 20 are in range. Oh boy. And we are going to attack with 14 out of 20. All out defense. On to your Saurus uh, warriors. So are you going to uh, all out defense? Yep. Your bullets are scary and I don't like them. 14 here. Uh, hitting on threes because I am Pyrofane Cult. Oh, not good. Is this one damage? Yeah, it's only one damage. No, my skin! And then wounding on threes. All right, you got that many coming at you. No, Ben. All right, these are three upstairs. Okay. Hey! Oh, kill two of them. Kill two. Oh, rally them. They're on an objective. Ah, that's true. Rally is available. You have to be wholly on an objective for the bonus, though. Mm. Okay, so that's those guys. What about the Magister? The Magister mm -hmm. also has an 18-inch oh, 18 range. He's not going to be in range. Oh, actually, at the end of the movement phase, we're supposed to do this. Oh, no. So at the end of the movement phase, I have one unit in range. On a four-up, they're going to take damage. So that's the Snackalites. No, they're fine. Your Croxagores are in range. Yes, and my Trog. They're fine. Troglodon is in range. He hits, hits. On a four up, gets D3 mortals. One mortals. Ah. Is it 13. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Now uh, back to the shooting phase. Now back to the shooting phase. So then all of these nuggets, and there's 18 nuggets, are going to go into your Croxagores. Now your Croxagores do have cover, but I will all out attack to negate that. I probably should have all defense team. All right. Three to hit. That's a lot of sixes. And twos to wound, because hmm. the Fate Master is buffing their plus, is their wounds. Curses. Just to wound? Yep. All right, and these are Rend 1, because these are the ones that got off their Gestalt Sorcery. All right, these are fives now. All right, let's kill a uh, Croxagore. Kill, I think you mean uh, kill all. Croxagore. Oh boy. Oh, you got some fives. But that's, that's, that's one is down to one and one is dead. All right, now I know who I'm doing for. Now my 10 man unit is going to go into your Carnosaur. Hitting on threes because of Pyrofane Cult. And then wounding on uh, twos because of the Fate Master. Oh yeah, thank you, Fate Master. All right, no, I'm definitely no rend on this. Oh, you, you grab one. On who? Your Carnosaur. What's his save? I think it's a four. All right, so you're gonna take five damage. All right, well he has. I gotta, 14 health. I gotta bracket him down. <laughs> All right, so he's down to nine. Then I'm gonna shoot with my three sky fires. He's gonna die, isn't he? I'm trying to make him dead. That's, Why? That's my goal, because I don't like him. He hits too hard. I'm actually just yeah. trying to bracket him so that his jaws don't do five damage each. That's ridiculous. All right, they each have an arrow of fate, but the leader gets a bonus one, so it's gonna be four arrows of fate. These are hitting on fours. Ah, oh, boo. Wounding on threes. What is that? And then I think that is it for the shooting attacks. Woo, that's a good one. Oh, because I'm Pyrofan Cult, at the end of the shooting phase, anybody that got hurt by Acolytes takes D3 mortals on a five up. What? So Saurus Warriors, do they take D3 Mortals? Nope. No. The Croxagore, do they take D3 Mortals? No. And the Carnosaur, does it take D3 Mortals? 
No, nobody's. The cult is weak today. The cult is weak. Good. All right. So that is it for shooting. Let's go into the charge phase. Please let me actually use my guy. Oh, you'll get to use him because I'm going to go ahead and charge my enlightened. All right, they're in. They're better if they go last. No, not anymore. It's different now. And then I'm also going to charge my ogroid. Oh, he only charged two. I'm going to command point reroll. <laughs> Seven might be enough. Let me we'll check. see. Yeah, seven's not gonna make. Okay. So just these guys get in. What about this guy? You already roll for them? I didn't charge them. I'm not gonna charge them. <laughs> and now I slap you. All right. Uh, one wound onto my guys here. Okay, so now we will go to combat. Uh, there's only one fight to be had. So I will go ahead and fight it. And I'm going to attack you with my Zangor Enlighten. Now, their new ability is you cannot receive commands. And I add one to wound rolls if I'm taking the second turn in a round, which I am. All right, I'm going to stamp you. Okay, go ahead and roll it. Got the stamp? All the stamps. <sighs> All right, kill off the dude. I squished him. That's sad. All right, so the two remaining are going to fight. All right, so I'm going to have seven total attacks with the Zinchi and Spear. Spear! I will go ahead and all out attack. And these are hitting on threes now. <laughs> Fine. And they're going to wound on two. Why? Oh, thank you. All right, one rend on these. So he's back to a five. Oh, you made two, but that's... Wait, no, I have the six shield on. Oh, it doesn't matter. So five, so fours. Yeah. All right, but that's four damage total. Uh, so he's down to five. That's not... Then so how much I'm damage is he taken? Uh, he was at 14, he's down to 5, so he's taken 9 so far. Oh boy. Then I'm attacking with my Vicious Beaks, hitting on 3s. Thank you. And wounding on 2s. Thank oh, dang. All right, no rend on these, so you have a 3 on these ones. Be alive. Okay. Yes. And then Teeth and Horns, D3 <sighs> attacks each, so 2 attacks. Woohoo! 3s. Woohoo! And 2s because of the Fate Master. <laughs> Okay, one rend, so you have uh, four up. Oh, lucky. You cannot lucky, kill lucky, him. Lucky, lucky, He will live another turn. He will live. All right, he can fight back. Yes, he has taken nine wounds. <laughs> so his stuff isn't that good. Good. Eh. All right, can't receive commands. Uh, Sunstone Spear. Uh, what, are, what, what is his mount trait again? Prime War Beast. You get plus one attacks with his mount. Yes. All right, one miss, two sixes, and threes. All right, one hit, one rend. No, it's improve the rend by one. Add one if it's attacking a hero. Oh. Okay. Well, we have rend two now. Okay. So it's rend two. Yep. Six up save. No. There it is. All right. Do it. Three attacks with my closet forearms because he has the thingy. Okay. Fives. Hey! And threes. What's the rend? Uh, none. Fours. Ooh. How much damage? Two damage. All right, two damage. So one guy's down to two. And plus one massive jaws because of. Mm -hmm. and... and. Plus one for Prime War Beast. Oh. Shit. Whatever it says on there, plus two. Okay. Fours. One. <laughs> and threes. Oh, goodness. It only did two damage anyway. Oh, good. Well, it would have killed that guy. Yeah. So that is the it, the end of combat. So first we're going to have Battle Shock. Since this is the end of the round, I'll just go ahead and use my command point to 
uh, avoid any Battleshock there. Right. You have Croc to roll Battleshock for Croxagores and for Saurus Warriors. Croxagores have a bravery of seven, so the Croxagores will be fine. Croxagores are fine. So I'm command, uh, do I even have to command point for the? Uh, no, I'm fine. What's the bravery? Eight. I lost two, yeah, so you're fine both ways. All right. I don't need Battleshock, boy. So that is it. I completed my objective. However, I only control two. Yes. So I get four points. It's four to five going into this round. All right, let's roll it off. Let's see I who's gonna it. get it. I need it. I would really appreciate it if you didn't have it. Three. That means I'm gonna get a two or a one. What did I tell you? We're gonna double. Why? We're gonna double. We're gonna double and I do my double dance. Yeah. All right. Why? Well, because I want you, I know that uh, you, Really need command points, so there you now you get three. I don't need them. You do, you need them. No, I don't. All right, for my heroic action, I'm gonna try to heal my Fate Master again. Uh. I do. Two. So he is up to five. five. Well, you know what? He's almost alive. You know what? What? You know what? Best ever. All right, let's mark him as his finest hour so that we don't forget. <laughs> For my battle tactic. Oh, would you like to mark anything as the proving ground? Where only veterans can contest it. Mm. That one. All right, so that one is the proving ground. Got it. All right, I'm gonna pick out muscle. No. What are you gonna out muscle of? Bye. Your, oh. these guys. Okay, just get uh, two guys on that. All right, so let's start with the castings. Castings. So first, 10 man unit, Gestalt Sorcery. Get it with an eight. Who's on binding? Uh, Stoke. Okay. Stoke on binding. All right, 20 man next to him, Gestalt. They get it with a 10. Stoke. Uh, the unbind range is 30, right? Yeah. Does that uh, mean- Stoke can do it anywhere on the board though. Yeah, but does that mean the Skink Star Pieces in range are just still way off? Uh, he in range of these guys? He's yeah. probably in range of those guys. Get it! Well, I got a nine. Oh, good. So they have it. So put Wait, you got a ten? Yeah, I got a ten. What? All right. I should have done croak. Yeah, croak would have worked. All right, and now the other 20-man group. They get it with a seven. Croak says no. Okay. Interesting. All right. So that was three croak unbinds so far. My ogroid... Because I did a crow combine here, a crow combine there, and we're also going to do a crow combine. Oh yeah, I guess it's just two so far. Yeah, and then that guy's done. All right, my ogroid is going to cast uh, the spell that makes him uh, infusion arcanum. No. Gets it with a six. I'm stopping it. Okay, with croak. With croak. Okay. It just stop it. Then I am going to cast. Uh, Umbral Spell Portal with my chicken. No! I get it with a 10. Oracle. Yes, the Umbral Spell Portal is on. No! Okay, and then my chicken will cast his good spell. No, what is that spell? It is called... Uh, I get it with a 10. Oh my. And it's called Infernal Gateway. I pick a unit with an 18, and I can pick a unit with an 18 of the spell portal. Oh boy. And if successfully cast, uh, I roll nine dice, and you get, um, for each three up, you get a mortal. Crook. Okay. All right. Three points. So I'm gonna go ahead and cast it on your Bastilla, actually. Why? Because he needs mortals to get his save up. Well, I'll do stuff to heal him. All right, every three up is a mortal. Oh. Uh, six mortals. So is it six? All right, and then lastly, my Magister is gonna attack with his Zinchian runes. Oh no, we're still in hero phase. Yeah. My Magister is gonna cast a spell. No, we can so go to the combat phase. We can go to the combat phase. The spell he's gonna cast is gonna be um, Turn me into a Zangler. I don't have that spell anymore. Uh, we'll do Arcane Suggestion. Just, oh, you know what? We're not going to do it. We're going to do Mystic Shield no. first. No. Mystic Shield. 
Dang it. All right. Is that is it over? That's it. He only gets if yes. he, he only gets the second spell if he successfully casts the first. Yes. All right. So that is it. So for... it's not the double, and if you get doubles again, you die. Spell. Actually, if you get doubles again, you die. If you get doubles on the second one, you die. <laughs> Except I took a command trait that says if he gets doubles, spell auto casts. And since the same trigger happens in Warhammer rules, I get to pick which one. What? So which one am I going to pick? The one where he dies or the one where it auto casts and I get two fate points? All right. So I guess we will go to the some movement phase. I wished everything you had in this cast. <laughs> so this is the before. It's all the ones. Okay. So everything moved up. Nothing ran because we've got some shooting to do. And uh, oh, at the, but at the end of the movement phase, these guys are outside of nine, but these guys are still with, couldn't get them out. So we're gonna roll for them. Proxagors, chocolate on. All right. So first, the snack lights four up. They're fun. Proxagors, take one. All right, that kills one. And the trog is fine. Okay, sigil of Zinch strikes again. No. And your, yeah, your swords are out. Okay, let's do some shooting. Uh, I'm going to put all 20 bolts into your swords. Why? I need them to be dead. Why? Because I, I don't like their faces. You already have the objective. I know. So we're going to have 20 shots. All right, 20 shots. Nah. Hitting on threes. And then they're going to be wounding on threes. So these are threes and threes. Come on, threes! Mm, I see some ones and twos in there. Yay. All right, and then wounding on threes. Oh, that's a lot of ones and twos. Yay. But we got that many. No rend. Yay. They did. They don't have rips, they Oh, right. They did. All right, three dead Snorris. All right, then my Magister is also going to shoot them. One attack. Threes and fours. So we're going to do threes and fours. No rend. Yeah. Ah, dang it. I three damage. No. Okay. Um, so. My chicken actually has a shooting attack. I forgot last round. You were gonna let me forget my chicken attack. I did it, I did it, I did it. It's I don't think his range is that good though. The range is, oh the range is 18. Oh, yeah. So I think I can get those uh snores. Let's see. Oh no. Ah. No, they're just out. Oh, can I get the croc? Yes. Yes, I can. Alright, we're gonna try and shoot the croc then. Uh, two d6 attacks. Six attacks. And we're going to be hitting on threes. Wounding on threes. Whew, look at this roll. Barely. Barely. One rend. So these are five ups. Aya. Uh... Oh my gosh. That's the one damage. That croc is down to three. No. Yeah. All right, so then we're gonna come over here. Okay, we're gonna start with the three sky fires. I'm gonna fire all three into your general. Meh. Okay, so I have four total attacks. And I wanna all add on this. I don't. So we're gonna go fours. Is there rend on this? Uh, there is rend, but before you do anything, yeah. they ignore any save stacking. They ignore any modifiers to save. Fours. Okay, sixes are our mortals. Threes. All right, you got one save with one rend, so that's a five up save. All right, now the mortals are four mortals. Okay, he's dead. He's dead? Oh no, he has five health, so he's at one. Yeah, he's at one. Whew! All right, Skyfire is good. Gerb. All right, we're going to go ahead and try to kill him off. So I'm going to shoot the whole unit of 10 into him. Okay, he's dead. He's got plus two to his save. You sure you don't want to roll it out? 
And there's just too many. Okay. That leaves the 20 man. The 20 man is going to get an all out attack. And then I'm going to shoot everything into the Saurus Knights. So that I don't have to worry about lookout, sir. Yeah. All right. Saurus Knights. There's not 20 of them, though. There's only 18 because you killed two of them. Yay. 18. Okay. Did you roll for those guys? Yeah, I did. Okay. Hitting on threes. Oh, my gosh. That is so many ones and twos. All right. Wounding on twos. Thanks to the Fate Master. That's a good amount. That's a good amount. Uh, they have the rend. So this is one rend on them. Uh, What's their save? Four. That's uh, Source Warriors. Look at Source Knights. Uh, it's probably also four. Four. Okay, so it's one rend, so fives are uh, good. All right, that's... So that kills two and a half. <sighs> okay, then at the end of the shooting phase, anyone who got hit hurt by bolts... Is going to take more on a five up. So that's the Saurus Warriors, five up. Nope. Saurus Knights, five up. Ooh, they'll take D3. They take two more. So one more dies. Drake, that was a shooting phase. That was a shooting phase. Okay. That is going to take us to the charge phase no. where all of us will charge. No. All right. Let's start with this group right here, who want to charge into your warriors. And in order to do that, they're gonna need an eight. No. Charge those warriors. No. An eight. Oh, that was lucky. Okay, doesn't look good yet, but maybe they'll be able to pile in. Whee. All right, um, any other, that's the main charge that I needed. Let me see, do I wanna charge anything over here? You know, I will charge these guys and try to get into your cold one. No. <sighs> they might be able to barely do it. I think they are. Okay, so that takes us to combat phase. We are going to start here. Now, I don't want to bring in the trog. That is for sure. Okay, so I have piled in here on the Saurus. I'm going to have, uh, all right, so I have five glaives. No, I'm sorry. I have six glaives and five normies. Six glaives, five normies. So on the glaives, we will go ahead and all out attack this. So they are going to be hitting on threes and threes. So let's do the glaives first. Threes and threes. Threes. No. Oh, no. boo. And threes. Okay, uh, one rend. Two damage. And then I've got five normies. Threes. Ooh, they all hit. And threes. Okay, one rend on these. I'm oh, sorry, no rend on these. No rend. Oh. That. Dang it. it. Means I'm not going to make my battle tactic. What was your battle tactic? To kill them off the objective. Oh, yeah. Uh, this guy. Get him. I have a war pick. There he is. Yay. <laughs> Please. One rend. Sixes. Woo. Fearsome jaws. Bonus jaw attack. Yeah. Bows. Ooh, got it. Threes. All right. One yeah. damage. All right, that kills a snackalite. And then snapping jaws. Oh, you need to put a guy back on. Why? Because. It was two damage with uh, my glaives. Yeah. And it should have been reduced. Yeah. Alright. Alright, so yeah. I'm gonna be coming here. Blah. And fours. Oh wait. <laughs> Alright. So I guess my guys will go ahead and 
Run away in terror? It probably won't run away in terror. Probably. Probably. Okay, so I I've got defense. six glaives plus three normies. Completely defense myself. <laughs> the most defense thing ever. All right, hitting on fours. Yeah. Wounding on twos because of the fate master. Sick of that guy. I'm killing him. Okay, one rend on these. So he's back to his normal four up. And these are one damage each. Yeah. So he's at five. And then I only had three baby glaives. What do you mean baby glaives? Fours and they almost. <laughs> Yay. Okay. Um, now. Now your source warriors can fight back. Okay. And then the Bastilla. And the Bastilla. That's true. So let's start. Uh, do they have suicide clubs or spears? I think they have clubs. They have clubs. Clubs! Forest to club! Nice. Well, they still have their jaws. Oh, yeah. Six jaws, five. I made two! Nice. E. Fours! Okay. <laughs> okay, good. Now the Bastilla. Hey, buddies. Ah, don't hurt my guys. Bluggening tail. Legend. Bluggening tail. Yes. All right. And threes. Yeah. Rend. One. So they're at sixes. Dying. D3. That will be one, two, three, four, five. All right. Let's try there. Murder them. Six up four. Super dead. Murder them. Right, so four of them die. <laughs> All right, I think that's it for combat. Yep. Battle shock. Battle shock. So. Command point. On which one? On the source, because otherwise you'll get your battle tech. All right, what about your warriors? Do you need to roll a command? You lost three of them. Their bravery is eight. Your knights. Eight. All right, so on a six, one could run. Why? Because you're so good at rolling sixes. I'm out. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. I'm going to rally him back. Yeah, you totally could. All right, I am going to... I'll go ahead and roll for this one. Yeah, you better get I'm six. good at rolling low. Oops. I'm good at rolling low. Well! All right, so their bravery is five, so that means an additional one runs. Yay! Yeah. All right, and then the other one, I lost four, so only on a one will they not run. So I'm using... I'm assuming you're going to... A destiny dice will be used! I and mean, let's see if I get it back. No! Right, five up. Oh, I got it. And it turns into a three. I turned my one into a three. But that means you have to use a three as. <laughs> All right. Yeah, threes are probably twos, and threes are probably like the worst. Yeah. Because they don't use it. They are not that really useful. Yeah, they're not as useful as some of the other ones. Okay. So, but at the end here, I did not make my tactic. Yeah. Which is not good. You're up by two points. But I get three points for the round. Because I control four objectives. And that means that it's your turn. I'm in trouble. So we each... Oh, no. I get a command point for my general. And then you get to just have a hero phase. Well, first, actually, we both decide our heroic actions. What do you want to do for heroic action? That guy heals. Actually, no. Oh, oh. he might have a healing thing. Yeah. Hey! Did you read it? He has a healing thing. Oh, he does? Okay. Yeah. So he heals. Now, what do you mm -hmm. want to do for your heroic action? Because you're supposed to do that first. Uh, his best day ever. Who's? <laughs> oh, okay. Scarbet. Um. So, oh, my heroic action. I am going to get a command point. So let me go ahead and roll that. No. <sighs> Should have tried to heal my fate master. Okay. Uh, lasers. All right, lasers. What terrain piece do you want to do? Now it's not as good. Yeah, I spread my army out a little bit. That one, I can hit those guys, those guys, and him. Sure can. All right, well, there's one left terrain piece. Wait, wait, wait. Let's choose a command, a uh, uh, battle tactic. Uh, what can I do? I'm going to go with eyeballs for eyeballs. Eye for an eye. Okay. Laser Where's time. The... Oh, there it is. All right, so Drake is going to choose time. eye for an eye. Laser time. <laughs> He wants lasers. All right, Drake, shoot off your lasers. Lasers. It's this one. 
Yeah, so who are you gonna do first? Fate Master. Fate Master. Four up. Whoa! Ten man unit. Hold on. Do I get a buff? You are just out of range for the buff. Sad. Okay. Yeah! No! These are terrible. Skyfires. Damn! Yeah! They get hit. Two. All right. One sky fires, his wings start to catch on fire. No! Ah! Oh, before you cast anything, do you want to dispel? I've got three endless spells on the battlefield. Any that you want to dispel? Uh, okay, I can't break your artifact. Because you have to do all your dispelling first before you cast anything. I'm going to try and break the spell portal. Okay, so you need to roll over a five. Stoked! Now I have to roll over. Now I have to show a four. Stoked! Stoked. All right, spell portal is bazapped. Uh, burning head. Who's casting it? Stoke. Okay. Stoke is a caster. All right, so that's a seven. I'm gonna try to unbind with my ten man group. You got a seven, so I need to show a seven. Out. Comments call. Oh no, I'm not gonna do comments call. I'm gonna do the uh, celestial deliverance. All right, who are you doing that on? Uh, 20 man unit. Okay. Uh, right. That is a Six, seven. seven, which is exactly what you need. Yeah, I'll yeah. Try to unbind. I'll go ahead and use two fake dice. To stop it? Stop it. Really? So I'm going to use a five and a three. Let's fake dice. That is an eight. So that un unbind. All okay. right, less fake points for you. Yep. All right. And again. So now you need an eight. Oh, he got it with a nine. nine. I'll try to unbind with my 20 man unit. You could stop it with my fate dice. I don't know if I want to. I got it with a nine. I had a nine. You had a nine? Yeah. Well, you had an eight. I had a nine. All right, I'll believe you. Okay, it does not stop. Because I had a six and a one, so seven, eight, nine. Okay, so that spell goes off and croak will not be taking it. <laughs> All right, so what are you going to do? How does that work? Pick up the three different enemy units within 10 inches of the caster invisible. And roll one dice for each unit. Two up suffers D3 mortals. If it's a chaos demon, uh, two up suffers three instead. Yes, right. now do you, you guys are demons. Uh, 10 inch pinion. I pick them. Okay. I pick, uh, they're the only ones I can pick. You can pick from your skink too. Oh yeah. Or your oracle. Remember all spells go through your oracle. Them and 20 man unit. Okay, so let's do the first 20 man unit. It just takes D3 or it on a something up? On a two up, it takes D3. All right. Yes. D3. Two. Sixes. No. No, two die. Boom. This guy. Just kill the Ultrix. I only need one. All right, now I will. On the Enlightened, two up. Yes. Okay. Oh. All right, they just take one. He's at one. He's at one. And then this 20 man unit who hasn't lost anybody yet. Yep. They will be losing maybe two. Oh, yeah, I got to roll. Sixes, shields, protect us. No. A little protection. A little protection. So they lose their first guy. What? My celestial deliverance. Cast it a third time, huh? Yeah. Okay. No, I'm out of, I'm out of spells. Oh, you are? Yeah. Okay. Uh. You! Oh, I forgot to get command points for my boys. Okay. Stoke! Stoke gives me one. Okay, you get one. Yeah! And Oracle. I did. Yeah, you get it. He gives you on a five. Yeah! There you go, you got some command points. I got three! Blazing Star, right? Captain Ooh! You can negative one to hit if I make this off. Okay. Eight! Okay. I have, I don't know if I have anybody that can unbind. So I've already used my 10 man, I've already used my, well I guess that other 20 man can unbind. Yeah. So I'll do the other 20 man. So you got an eight. Eight. Oh, one, one under, all right. All right, they get, because it's coming from him. Mm -hmm. So they get negative one to slap. All right, they are minus one to hit. My Oracle casts the comments call. Okay. I can't call the comments. I do get one more fate point though for that successful. I can't. Cast. Uh, I don't do comments call. Oh, good. 
That one's called ugly, and I don't like it. Okay. I think that's all your spells. Yep. You're not giving me very many fate points, so I don't think that's cool of you. Well, I'm not getting very many good stuff. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, it is... My movement phase. Your movement phase. So we'll do a quick before and after. Oh, actually, in the hero phase, uh, rally. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. He's out of combat. Rally, two dice, set, sixes. Crocs. Oh, he gets a Crocs back. Hi, Lucky dog. Lucky dog. Hi, buddies. Okay, now we'll do a before and after. Yes. This is before. Okay, so we're back. So this whole contingent swoogled up and around. Otherwise, the croak moved up a little bit. Oh, and uh, Drake decided he actually, actually wanted to dispel the sigil, not the portal. So we put the portals back onto the sigil. Yeah, because the sigil's going to hurt me. Okay, so yeah. let's start with shooting. Who wants to shoot first? Stilla on! All right, Stilla, Stilla. Stilla, Stilla. I get seven Stillas. Okay. Stillas! Oh, that's a lot of Stillas. That's pretty good. And three Stillas. Oh, wait. It, I said three Stillas and it gave me three Stillas. One Ren. Sixes. Two Jamage. Two damage each. Mm. Six up. Yeah. All right, so three die. Three die. And then I will use my meteoric javelins from the stinks. Stink meteoric javelins. Fives. I hit two. Nice. And fours. I got one. Any red? No. Fives. Stinks are good at throwing things, as it turns out. <laughs> and then the stink star priest will use a venom bolt. Uh, okay, who's he shooting? Uh, those guys. Okay. Nice. And threes. Woo! One wrench. All right, these are sixes. Oh, I said one. One damage? One damage. Uh, six up. Oh, one guy dies. One guy dies. And then... Frog. Okay. Frog. Oh, it's D3. I got three dice. There you go. Uh, makes me feel better. Okay. I think that's it for shooting. That's it for shooting. Oh no, your hero has the fusil of conflagration, right? Conflagration fusil. All right, yes. that's the D3. I will use the dice on the floor. Okay, thank you. Two. All right. One. Fusil of conflagration zaps. Zap. Zap. Um, I think that's it for shooting. That's gonna take us to the charge phase. Where Crocs would you like to charge? Crocs charge. All right, they're gonna have to go around. Unless they go a three inch through. They can't go through. They don't. The base isn't wide enough. My uh, endless spell is blocking it. Eight. Oh, eight should be plenty to go around for sure. Okay. Uh, stinks. Try and fit in through that tiny hole. Yeah, stinks could make it through for sure. Come on. You need stinks. probably like a six or seven. Stinks. Let's go. Six. Six might be. Pull enough. out the measure. Wait, 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 no, we have. Okay. So many enemies, so many. Any other enemies. charges you want to make? Uh, this guy. He's got a three incher. E. He's in. Eleven. Okay, well, that takes us. Is that the last of your charges? Uh, no, we'll actually just go into this guy. That's my sole goal. Okay. Is that the, it for your charges? Uh, yes. Okay. Oh, yes, boss. Who do you want to attack with first? Crocs of course. All right. They have their stink buff now. They sure do. So stinks give them plus one to hit rolls. So it's like they have all that attack on them. Yeah. Four Drake, but actually eight, because there's two Drake Bite Malls here. No, no, that's just the normal. Yeah, there's, there's not the Drake Bite Mall. It's the, oh yeah, it is the Drake Bite Mall. Yeah. It's not the new Moonstone Hammer. Yeah, so you have eight. Threes. Oh, yes. All right. And threes. All right, one rent. Sixes, please make these. Boxcars. Dang it. Uh, it's three damage because they're veterans. Yep. So six total damage. 
four, four total damage. All right, do the other ones. Uh, Vice like Jaws. I will get four of them because I'm coalesced. Come on, six. All right, these are two mortals in addition. In addition? In addition. Wow, all right. Not subtraction, addition. Let me That's just what roll those real quick. Oh! Right, so two more, I'm taking. And threes. Wait, do they count as uh, two damage because? Yeah, everything's two damage. Okay. So what's the rent? Uh, one. Sixes again. Ah, these are two damage each. Yep. I like having <laughs> the crossbows and veterans. Yeah, those bounty hunters are not good. Uh, I saved one, so that's five more. So 11 Ooh. die. Uh-oh. Oh. That's a lot. Okay, so there's one guy left. There were 12 men in that unit, and you kill 11. All right, we're going to come over here, and we're going to do some slapping. All right, so I'm going to have four. All right, so let's do the one on your source knights. So there's four guys. One knights? is a glaive. What do you mean knights? It's knight singular. So one is a glaive. We'll do the glaive first. It's not the leader. Ooh. So hitting on fives, wounding on twos. Okay, one rend. Yeah. Yes. Then three normies, hitting on fives, wounding on twos. Okay. Hey. Yeah. Oh, saved it. Yes. All right. Now on your hero, though, I've got. So five glaives, three normies. We'll do the five glaives first. Fives. And twos. All right, one rend on these. Yeah! All right, well, it would be two damage, but it's one damage each. So that takes you down to three. Oh boy. And then the three normies hitting on fives. Oh, that didn't hit. Yeah. Oh. Oh. And wounding on twos. Okay. No rend. All right, let so, me... Uh, you're at a three up. Yep. Yes. Got it. All right. We will use the bestial dawn. Okay. Oh, boy. That's not good. Is it? Oh, dang. One rend? Yep. Sixes. Oh, dang. All right, make one six. One six chance. Six. Oh. Yeah. They're down. They're dead. And it's my objective again. And it is your objective again. Okay. Um, I think that's all my guys, though. Yep. I don't have anybody else in combat. So you've got your hero. And, and uh, that's this it. boy. And this boy. Oh, he already, I thought he already attacked. Nope. Okay, yeah, then you got both of them. All right, let's start with my Stero. All right. Threes. Nice. Twos because of... Yay! One win! All right, sixes. Oh. That's a damage. Sixes. Yeah, it's not. Bing on my Arcanite shield. Okay. Okay. Do some Jawas. Fours. Okay. And twos because of the thingy. Nice. All right, now you're other. Nope, I have snapping jaws. Oh, okay, snapping. And threes. Nice. And threes because of the thing on my jiggy. Why? Friend? Nine. So fives, fives. Oh gosh, it was there and it rolled. Sixes, is it one damage? Sixes. Oh, one other one goes down. Yeah. We're slowly but surely killing them all. You're a butt surely. All right. My Knigget will be good at his job. Just watch me. He will attack with a Celestite Blade. Okay. A threes. Mm, got him. Yes. And a threes. Rend? None. None Fives. of this is any rend. Sixes. No. Dang. All right. I get two powerful jaws because of my thingy. Five. I made one! Yay! And fours! Yeah! No run. Fives! Four! Sixes! <laughs> My guys are dying like one wound at a time. It's ridiculous. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, okay, that's another one. And I have snapping jawas! Threes! Yes! Okay. Fours! 
Fives. Yeah, ah! there we go. Finally. Nice. All right, I think that's it for the combat. So at the end of combat here, I well, at the end of the round, I do owe you battle shock. So yeah. I'm gonna spend my command point to pass it. And then, uh, as for points, you control three objectives. Not as many. So you're gonna get four points on the round. Yep. All right, now we're tied. Because you did get your eye for an eye. We are tied now, correct? We are, no, you're up by one. Oh, nice. Well, well actually, you're up by two. Oh. Because, uh, yeah, I'm at seven, you're at nine. Because I missed my battle tactic last oh, time. Oh, yeah. Okay, right, please, I off. really need it. I need it super bad. Oh. I'm going to get one, and you're going to go first. Mm, 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 please, mm, Dad. Mm, no, please. I have to do my dance. This is my dance right here. And it means it means that I will be going next. Why? Because I know you wanted two command points. I don't. You do. And so you have them already. See, that's why you got two. All right. Woo! That was lucky. That was luck Fantastic McLuckerson. <laughs> All right. So we are going to do a couple things here. First, I'm also going to pick eye for an eye. Because if that's the way we're going to play this game, eyeing each other's eyes. I'm going to eye your eyes since you eyed my eyes. And then uh, for my heroic, uh, I think I'm going to get a command point. Ooh, which I get. Mm. And I'm going to put that command point on that guy. What well, still is best to you know. What command, what uh, do you want? Uh, command point. I get it. You do get it. Yeah. That's what you get. All right, let's cast some spells. No. So we're going to start with the unit of 10. No. The uninjured unit of 10. Gestalt sorcery. Oh, they get with an 11. Okay. Yeah, you haven't heard him yet. <laughs> Are you going to try to unbind? Who? Cook. Okay. You show a 10. Uh, you cannot defeat me. Oh my gosh. Your unbind rolls are ridiculous. Uh, how many guys are left over here? Do I still have nine or is it less than nine? You have nine exactly. All right. So they're going to also cast Gestalt Sorcery then? No. They still have a scroll guy. So. Oh, they miscast. Awesome. They're going to take one, which they do not work. All right. They're no longer a wizard. All right. I'll lose the scroll guy then. They're not, they're not, Blech. now that they have no scroll guide, they can't cast spells. They're like, uh, oh, we forgot. We how forgot. do we cast spells? All right. Um, well, I'm going to use my chicken. We're going to cast in chicken Fernal wing, Gateway. Chicken wing. Oh boy. I get it with a 12. Oh, uh, right. You can try it on mine with Lord Croak. Croak! All right. So now the question is who gets infernalized? <laughs> You might as well kill the stinks. I mean, okay. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna go with that Bastilla again. That Bastilla no! is scary to me. No! I'm shooting your bird now. <laughs> All right, every three up is a mortal. Can I get none? Oh, only. Sorry, four or five. Five. Oh, he's down to one! <laughs> At least he's at his worst bracket. That's something. He still has right. a four up save. And then for my second chicken spell. He only has five bullets and he, no. My second chicken spell, I'm going to try to cast uh, a Sigil of Zinch again. No! Let's bring that boy back out. Six. I'm going to re-roll it. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Because my one thing lets me re-roll. I get it with a 12. Work up! Crook, I kind of need you here. All right, so one, it doesn't even matter. All right, I'm at 13 fate points. Okay, then I'm going to cast with my Magister. My Magister is going to cast the most mystical of shields. He got it with a double. I mean, it's not unbindable. Yeah, with two fate points. Why? 
that that doesn't seem fair. And that's... because he has a successful cast, he gets to cast again. Well, what if he gets doubles and then he blows up? He's a cult demagogue. <laughs> All right, for his second one, I will go ahead and it's cast. It's that your opponent chooses what happens, not you. I'll go ahead and cast Arcane Suggestion. No, you should. We'll suggest nothing. What did I tell you? Mm, that's only six. It's not insufficient. How many spells have I done? But, uh. All right, so we're going to do a quick <sighs> movement phase. And so I've done three. Oh, wait, where are your spells? Okay. Then we'll come back. All right. Eat. Now, at the end of the movement phase, basically everything shifted around. This guy moved over here. We're going to try oh. to take out the Bastilla. We're going to see what happens here. Oh. But first, the Sigil. So. Oh, I could hit everyone except for your Ogrid. Sigil, let's hit the Bastilla first. On a five, I uh, know, on a four up. Go away. Sigil, he's dead. Wait, oh. All right, then let's hit the Saurus Warriors. Nope. Then let's hit the Croxagore. Well, I get a put it away? Yep. Crox take three. All right, that kills one. Yes. All right, and I got another rally target. <laughs> Stop rallying them. No. They, they would be all the way dead if you didn't rally. Uh, let's do the Skinks. Nope, they're fine. And let's do yeah. Mega Skink on Troglodon. Mega Skink. He takes one. That's right, yeah, healing. <laughs> back down with you, sir. Back down to 13. Well, he's gonna heal right back up, so, uh-uh. Okay. All right, then it's time for the shooting phase. So, what do I want to do with that? I think the scariest thing to me right now is your Troglodon. So we're gonna shoot into that. It's Lord Crocoak. Oh, I mean on this side. On this uh, side. Yeah, Lord Crosshair. All right. So I have almost killed all of them. We're going to do the Magister. Okay. So the Magister gets one attack. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, we're going to go into your truggy. Ba, 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 do you want to do an all out? Yeah. All right. I believe. Threes. I believe. And fours. I believe extra. Okay. There's no rent on this. All the belief. All right, then my chicken will also shoot into him. Chicken wing, chicken. 2d6 attacks. Ah! 10 attacks. All right, so with 10 attacks, these are going to be threes and threes. So threes. Oh, yay. Mm. No, no, that was a three. I just okay. bumped it. And threes. All right, no rend on these. Oh, I'm sorry, one rend on these. Ba, 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 da. Yeah, I think he's a four up save. So yeah. it's all missed. So that's going to be four damage. Uh, he's down to nine. Okay. So that's all that shooting. Now we're going to come over here. So I'm going to put all of it into your hero. So I've got two Why? forces. I've got eight shots. Eight shots going into your hero. All right. So these are threes because of Pyro Fame Cult. Oop, lost one. Lost one. It's sucker. Oh, lost it again. Here we Dad! Go. Ha! It was a miss anyway. It was angry at you. It I was. So many times. And twos, thanks to my fate master. Of Zinch. All right, four into your hero. Uh, there is no rend on this. All right, so that is... Three damage. Three damage, which killed him. No, he's a... Oh. Now, my ten-man unit is going to shoot into the Saurus Knight. Threes. Oh, look at all those threes and ones. Woo! And twos. Oh, boy. Oh, he's dead. All right. So you got that many. No rent. Oh, it's only one damage? Yeah. Dang it. OK. Um, are, are you guys all good trying to slaughter Lord Croak? I am going to shoot all four of my Zangor missiles into Lord Croak. No! I'm going to take him off the board. I'm actually going to use my two sixes for two of the rolls, or I have foreseen it. Uh... And then two of the rolls hitting on uh, fours, wounding on threes. All right, so you've got one what wound. What if they just stay there forever? These are mortals. Oh. You've got one wound. It's minus one rent. All right, so this is... Who is this on? Croak. 
Why? The D3 damage. So five. Okay. That's not very much damage. I was hoping it would be more than that. All right, but that's all I have for shooting. All right, so now shooting first? you've got to roll three dice and see if Crook dies. If he sixes, does. Sixes and fives. If he does, sixes, the game's over. Sixes and fives. Sixes and fives. Oh, no. No, you're fine. Okay. Because eight plus five is 13, so he heals. He's fine. Okay. All right, so charge phase. Um, my only charge actually is going to be this guy. So let's roll for the ogre. Oh, he only got a five. Not charging for you. Oh, what about with these guys? Oh, yeah, let me charge them because they can make it into the other guy. A four. Ooh. Well, a four, I think, barely makes it into the Ooh. other guy. All right. Uh, that's going to be it. So for my attack, I'm going to might as well start with these guys. And now my enlightened. Would you like to all out defense? Who? Nope. Your knight that I'm about to kill. No, he's dead. That's right, because you can't all out defense because of my babbling stream of secrets. You don't need to be so offensive. I do. No, you don't. Well, if I did somehow live, why are you guys that one? All right, so these guys are hitting on fours. That wasn't a very good roll. And they're wounding on twos, thanks to the Fate Master. Okay. All right, didn't matter. One rend on these. Oh, I saved one. Yeah, you did. All right, one damage each. Exactly enough. Would have been two damage, but your stupid scaly skin's all scaly all the time. It doesn't matter, you would have died anyway. Um, and then that is it. Yeah. I don't think there's any battle shock that we need to worry about. Wait. Oh yeah, I lost one guy. Yeah. Um, I'll go ahead, and, oh, actually, so I'll res this guy, I'll use a, uh, my three, to pass the battle shock on him. No, I can't, I can't pile in. Hold on. I don't get it back. And then the two sixes I use. I'm gonna roll to see if I get those back. <laughs> nope, I'll get back. My screams of power. Okay. It's not really so power, at the it's screams of power. In here, I still control, I only control three. Yes. Which is not more than you. So, but I did get eye for an eye. I think so you're So I'm gonna go one ahead now. and get four points. You're, you're winning, you're winning. I'm still winning. Well, you haven't, we're in the middle of the round, right? Yeah. You can't really tell until the end of the round. Let's choose your heroic and your um, battle tactic. Oh, barge through enemy lines. Okay, barge through. Drake is gonna barge through. Beep, beep. Okay. All right, command point from Croak. Croak gives me one command point. All right. Oh yeah, I get one from my hero here. I have three now. Good, and your star priest? Yep. All right, now, what's your heroic action? My heroic action will be to heal my boy. The trog. Well, you get a free heal first, yep. right? So do the free heal first. Nope, doesn't make it. Okay, now you're going to do your heroic. Nine. That might be too big. It's way too big, because bravery's six. His <laughs> bravery's only six. He's a scary boy. It All right. sucks. I'm going to go ahead and get I a... get to laser you. I'm going to command point it. Which I don't get. Okay. Lasers! 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 I can, I'm can. i choosing this as my laser target so I can hit you, 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 and you. All right, let's start with the hurt unit of uh, Acolytes on a four up. Acolytes! Acolytes! D3. <laughs> and. I can't do nope, my. Nope, one dies. I did. They're dying one wound at a time. One wound at a time. Okay, now the unhit. Hurt ten man unit. Uh, okay, now the skyfires. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Oh, that kills the skyfire. Now you only have three skyfire missiles. <laughs> All right. Now the fate master. Two. He's Mark at three. three. I'm gonna kill him. Stop killing him. He's so good. Nope. That plus one to wound is amazing. I'm going to kill him dead. All right, that takes us to spells, but I don't think you have any of those. Yes, 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 yes. All right, what do you want? Uh, you, you buddy, are you? Mm. Artifact destruction. 
All right. Please make it. 10. All right, I will try to unbind. Oh. All right, so I need a the six. The I need a six. No! No! All right, I'll re-roll it thanks to my uh, Nimbus. No, 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 no. Oh, dang it. It was worse. All right, so I think it does. It does D3 damage. D3, so go ahead and do D3 on him. Two. All right, I think he's down to six. And now in a five up, his artifact okay. is blown up. Okay. Yeah! Man, you are so good at blowing up artifacts. It's crazy. Cross that one out. All right, so I get uh, I get fate point at least. So there's that. <laughs> I don't think that's. I gotta be. I gotta just take the wins where I can get them. All right, uh, that Thanks. was your first spell. Yep. Uh, I will now cast uh, celestial deliverance. Okay. Deliverance Seven. celestial wing. Oh boy. Get it with an eight. Eight. I will try to unbind with my chicken one more time. That's your last chicken to unbind. Yeah, I'm gonna use two fate dice, five and a four to auto unbind that. And then do I get the one back? Whoa! One back. And they now are a six and a two. Twos are the worst. Yeah, twos are, yeah, twos and threes. Really, really not great. All right, so what is your third spell? Uh, same thing. All right, you're gonna celestial deliverance again. I will deliver your celestial weight. Seven, eight, nine. All right, I'll try to unbind that one with my chicken. chicken. So I need a five. You know, your ch chicken is level three spell hazard? Two. This is only the second unbind. No, he tried to stop my mystical and forging in the field. Right, that's the first one. Yeah, and then you tried to stop the celestial deliverance and succeeded. No, I, I uh, used fake dice, so I just used my ogre. Fine. I should have I should have said, but yeah. I'm all, I'm saving the chicken for the this. I'm gonna re-roll it. I'm gonna get new dice. Five, ten. Got it. All right. Well, now that your chicken's done. Yeah, my chicken's done. He has one more spell. He's going to catch the same thing again. Okay. okay. He needs a nine now. Oh. Down with a 12, so I can't unbind. I'll take my fake point. Thank you. Well, you guys will be taking damage. All right. Who's taking damage? They are. They are. Is everybody within 10? Uh, it's three people within 10. Oh, three people within 10. Okay. Him, him, and him. Who's him? The ogre. The ogre. Okay. Oh, uh, no, this guy, actually. Fate Master. Fate Master. I start with the Fate Master, see if you can just kill him off. Oh, wait, wait, before you choose the Fate Master, he has a four up spell ignore. So on a four, it, it is worthless to him. I don't care. Okay, so the Fate Master. Woo -hoo -hoo! Does he take three or does he ignore? He does not yeah! ignore! Yeah! Fate Master is Fate Mastered. All right. It was his fate to die in, against the It Pope. was his fate. Okay, now you're uh, enlightened. Okay, enlightened. Three. Three mortals. Yep. Okay, I didn't know if you were meant. You rolled a three. I couldn't see. So uh, that means one, and so this guy's at two. That means. That guy was at one. Yeah. Oh, okay. And now those guys are gonna do it. Okay. One. All right, let's see if they've- Oh, the Fate Master's finally dead. I'm glad. All right. Comets call! Comets call. Call these comets! Yes! Seven? Yes. All right, I'll have my Magister try to unbind. No! Oh, seven. Dang. Booyah! All right, so who are you? Uh, D3. D3 units, right? D3. I get one unit. Okay, who are you doing it on? And Anywhere on the board. All right, try to kill off that enlightened. The elephant is slain! Oh, okay. Well, at least I don't feel bad, Chuck. And I get a point for that one. Jerk. All right, and you've got one guy there. This guy is going to do uh, his zapping spell. That makes you naked one to hit. Okay. Six. Seven. We all have such good spells. Uh, my 10 man unit, my last unbind. I need to show a seven. They can get a plus one because of their scroll. Nope. Oh. They miss unbind. They miss unbind. And oh, because uh, Croak cast, well, he cast four spells. Yep. So uh, we're going to roll four dice to see if he takes any mortals. Uh, two mortals. All right, roll your three dice. That's This is the end of the round. So he's not going to take any more. Yeah, he's fine. What do you mean by the end of the round? This is the spells. End of the phase. End of the phase. 
Okay, so I think that does it for all. Oh yeah, so that went off, right? Yeah. Oh, well I'm gonna get another fate point. Okay. All right, let's do the movement phase. Movement Quick phase. before and after. This is the before. Yep. All right, do it up. Oh, actually in the hero phase I went to rally Croxies. Oh, okay. Please. Rallying Croxigores, they rally on a five. Because they're- Because they're holy within. Whew, I got scared. I got scared again. Oh boy. All right, now we'll do the movement phase. Okay, we're back. So Croak moved over, these guys all moved up. This guy technically is on top of this. But it's hard to balance. So we're not gonna worry about too much about that, but that takes us to shooting. You have one, two shooting attacks. You, zap them. Stop zapping them. <laughs> okay, one zap. One zap. Rend? One. Sixes. One damage. One damage. Sixes. Ah. You've killed four of my units. Uh, and now your spitter. Wait, I have a whole bunch of stinks right here. Did stinks die? Oh, they must have. So how many do you have there? What's Four. their bravery? Oh boy. Their bravery is five. All right, so I had a, did you have command points last turn? Yes. All right, we'll say you used one. So yeah, use one. Uh, shooting with your troglodon. Troglodon. D3 troglodons. One troglodon. Who's, who's you shooting at? Uh, your magister. Okay. I get plus charges if this makes it. Yes. And. Yes. No rend. No rend. So he's got Mystic Shield. So this is a three up save. I get plus charges. All right. That's all the shooting. So now it's time for the charge phase. Who is charging? Uh, Stink. Oracle. Okay. He doesn't need that much because technically he's right yeah. here already. You got a seven. That's fine. You want to come in with this guy? Yeah, I want to get as far to the side as I can. Okay. It stinks! Oh, this stinks. Oh, this five. Uh, and they also want to come into the general? Yeah. And they can. Who is You're going to charge with Lord Croak? Yeah. All right, charge Lord Croak. I'm trying to keep him stuck because I have to do this. We're going to, get, we're going to do a wrap around. Yep. We're just leaving the Lord of Change to his own stuff. Ten! He's in. All right. Well, you get to choose who is attacking first. So what do you want to do here? Try the Oracle. All right. Oracle on my guy. I will go ahead and all out defense my general. Okay. Divining Rod. Uh, I'll attack. Divining Rod. Okay. And fours. Or, yeah. One rend. All right, so I'm still at a three up. Good. And clad four limbs. Threes, because of all the deck. And threes. No rend. Three up. Good. My magister cannot be killed. All right. How do you know? And this is Venomous Jaw, so I get plus an attack. And yeah, threes because of the auto attack. And then fours. Red? None. Threes. I'm not, I'm good. All right, so I think I will go ahead oh, and- Oh, this guy gets plus one to casting, the spawn and bind him. There you go, good to remember. All right, I think I'm gonna go ahead and- Oh, he also, he has, he also can do it anywhere. What, can do what anywhere? He can stop spells anywhere. Oh, cool. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do this unit into Croak. I might as well. And that me, bro. So I've got five glaives. I knew you would do that because that gives me more attacks. That gives me one, two, three, five attacks. Well, you could have piled and gotten them, so it would have been all right. All right, so uh, hitting on, I'm not gonna all out anything, I don't think. This is the last turn, right? This is, yes. This is the yeah, end I'm not gonna all out. All right, hitting on 
fours. Wounding on threes now. I went first turn one, then you've been going first. Oh, turn it was actually wounding on fives, but I think they were all fives. Mm, I don't think they were. I think I saw at least one three right. and one four. We'll take one out. Wounding on threes. All right. One rend. Yeah. Oh, that's six damage. On who? Cloak. Cloak. All right. That's not good. I didn't the combat. We'll roll and see if he heals. Okay, so uh, you can attack with stinks. You can attack with broke. Stinks. All right, you've got five stinks. Bars. Yes. Not bad. Not bad. Eep. And bars. And what's the rend? None. All right, so he's at three up. Oh, he get, one gets through. Yay. One he good. takes a damage. That was useless. And now he will strike back. Why does he have so much health? So I'm going to put, I'm going to go ahead and put everything into the skinks. So first I get one warp steel sword hitting on fours. He sucks. And then D3 teeth and horns. One <laughs> hitting on fours. It sucks too. All right. He couldn't do anything. All right, Lord Crook. All right, Lord Crook can give his smack a I give, I get five ties because there are five malls in combat with me. Mm -hmm. And threes. One rend. He gets rend? Yeah. Double Lord Crook. It's a Sixes. force barrier, obviously. One damage each? Yep. Sixes. Ah, two more die. Boom, boom. All right, at the end of combat phase, I'm gonna spend a command point. Okay, we gotta roll. For what? Oh, oh for, for crow, yeah, roll three. Uh, 10, 11. 17. Ooh. Ooh, All boy. right, heal him up. All right, so I spent the command point, so my acolytes do not run. And then for my birdie birds, I have a bravery of six. So on a six, one could run. I'm gonna go ahead and use my two. I have foreseen it. Let's see if I get it back. I don't. <laughs> but at least I don't lose any more sky flyers. All right, but at the end of the round here, Drake, I don't believe you killed any units. So you did not, oh no, you were trying to barge through enemy lines. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, you totally have. You totally have barged through. And you still control three. So you have the same as me. So you are going to get four points. I'm still on top. Yeah, you're winning by two points. I really need the double. And if you get the double, it's going to be it's going to be bad for me. But if you get the double, four. you're going to have to beat. Oh, right, who's done first? Oh, it's going to be me for sure. Why, please? All right. So, Dad, please. No, here's Why? two for you. Here is two for me. I am also going to barge through. I'm just copying you, I think. I'm also going to barge through enemy lives. Stop! I'm barge, barge copy. Are you going to try and take this objective? That's exactly what I'm going to do. Yeah. Well, I have a guy there. I know you have a guy there. Charge me. All right. So, um, heroic action. Hey, bip, 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 bip. I think I'm going to... Oh, I'm going to heal my Ogre, for sure. Come on, Ogre. Heal up. Nope. Oh, that's, I think, probably <laughs> over his, his bravery. Yeah, his bravery's only eight. Yeah! Right, what do you want to do? Ah, uh, command points. Okay. So, you yeah. get it. Did you want to rally? Yes. All right, spend so a command point. All right, you get seven dice. All right. I get one, two, three, four, five of them back. Oh my gosh. You are so lucky with your rolls. All right. Well, I guess I'll go to spells. So my 10 man unit, they're going to do what they do best. And that is cast Gestalt Sorcery. They no. haven't cast it on themselves once. Not even once this whole game. But today they're going to do it. Hey, they got it with a six. Or a crook. 
No. All right, my Ogroid is going to cast a spell that gives him plus one to hit and wound. Nope. This is dumb. No, it's smart. All right. My Magister is going to cast Mystic Shield again. Gets it with a nine. Crook. And That's stop. an eight. So I get the Mystic. No, I need to stop that thing because you never die. And then because he... Oh, that's a hit point. And then, because he cast uh, successfully, he's going to cast again. This time, we're going to do the suggestion. Cast on an eight. Get with a nine. This is your third unbind his croak. Yes. You got it. All right. Now you're chicken. Now the chicken. Um, all right. First, I'm going to cast Zinch's Firestorm. No. Cast on an eight. No, cast on a 30. Five minute re-roll it. I cast on a 30. I get a 12. All right, all right. All right, pick an enemy within Boy, 12, sick. roll nine dice on sixes. Each six is D3 mortals. I don't like this anymore. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit your, your uh, trog. Let's see if we can get that trogy down. He is at nine health, sir. All right, so I just need a couple, a lot of sixes. Here we go, sixes. Oh, I got three sixes. So how much is that? D3 each. That is seven mortals. Sorry, it's a two. All right. And then... Um, this is not going well. My chicken is going to cast his infernal gateway. Uh, the dog. I don't know yet. I'm gonna roll it and we're gonna see well, what, we're gonna see what happens. Die if you oh, I got it with a 12. All right. Try, and, try to unbind it on a 12, because it gets plus one, right? Yeah. Oh, so close. I should have done it with Lord Croak. Oh, you're out of cloaks. Yeah. I'm out of spells too. Yeah, let's try to kill off the drug. I knew it. I know his weight. Every three up's immortal. I only need two. He's dead. He's dead. So with all the spells cast, I guess we're just going to go into movement phase. I don't like that phase. So this is the before. Okay, we're back. So shuffled these guys around. This guy retreated because he's a scaredy little general man. But we did manage to Can move... Can he be the coward? Two, yeah. We did manage to move two guys onto this objective. I had to run him with an auto six. Uh, but I think it was worth it to take that objective. Okay, so now we're going to go to shooting. Uh, so first, my my chicky is going to shoot. I'm going to shoot into the Croxagore. Any all-outs you want to all-out? Uh, who are you shooting? The Croxagore. Uh, how much damage could this do, Max? Depends on how many 2d6s I roll. All right, you roll the 2d6 first. Then no, now. you have to decide when I pick you. No. You're not going to use it? No. Nope. Well, I'm going to get 7, so average. I should have used it. Uh, I don't know. Seven's probably not going to kill the crosses. Three misses. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? What am I doing, Drake? What? At the end of my movement phase, you know what's happening. 20 fate points are being spent. Oh. Okay, now that the pinks are in and ready to party, as only pinks can. What do you mean? They're, they're good partiers. Oh. Now it's going to be time for my chicken to shoot. So 2d6 into no. your Croxagores. You're not using any. Oh, no, I had seven. That's right. I only rolled. And now that Croxagore is going to have to suffer under. Oh, wait. I know another thing we didn't do. Oh, my gosh. We're just forgetting all kinds of things. You know what else we didn't do? The sigil. All right, it's going to hit these three. What? It's not in range for the Croxagore? Is it? No. Nope. Oh, barely out. But the skinks, yes. Yeah. Okay. Skinks! I'm in a Four up! Nope. Saurus! Four up! Yep. I just rallied them. Two. Okay, now the Lord of Change. Hitting on three into your Croxador. You have killed nine of them now. Put them on the thing, because we're going to have to see about rallying. Or, I mean, uh, battle talking. And then three to wound. Oh, that was a, what a good roll. All right, this is one rend, so you're at a five up save. They're only one damage each. Which? 
Four. Exactly enough uh. to kill the gore. This guy cannot shoot because he uh, retreated. These guys cannot shoot because they retreated. Those guys can shoot. But they're sad, so they can't. I'm going to shoot your hero in the... Uh, in the I thing. have cover and plus one to be stopped. Yeah, yeah. This is... All right, so... Uh, fours because of the minus one to hit. Wow, that was terrible. <laughs> and then uh, threes to wound. <laughs> All right, two wounds. Now you get a plus one save. Nice. Does he have four now normally? No! The five normally, so that is one wound. He's up four. And that means at the end of the shooting phase, on a five up, he'll take D3 more. No! Oh, it was a six for half a second. Oh, actually, I'm going to shoot my uh, Skyfires into him, too. Sorry. Ouch. Oh, I hope that hits. Nope. Uh, that definitely does not hit. <laughs> Four is to hit. Dang it. Uh, that takes us to charge. The only charge I'm going to do is I'm going to charge. Actually, I'm going to. Oh, I was going to try to charge the Croxagore, but I can't now. I'm going to charge my chicken into your stinks. He only needs the three. Please don't double one this. All right. Oh. Oh, I'm going to do this just to block. Just to block you guys from coming in with your expert conquerors. All right. At the end, I will do a stamp. I wasn't even trying for that objective. I was trying for this one. Oh, well. That would also be scary. Stamp. Oh, come ba, ba, on. Ba. Bird, learn how to stamp because he's got those little chicken legs. He can't stamp you with his chicken legs. They all skipped leg day. They did. All right, that is going to take us to combat. The only combat is this one, so I will go ahead and attack. Mm -hmm. Now, he has the Wicked Beak and the Staff of Zinch. He does not have a Baleful Sword. So, Staff of Zinch. Staff of Zinch, four attacks. I know. Uh, wounding on ones. Oh no, hitting on threes. Hitting on threes. Oh gosh. Wounding on ones. Okay. What do you mean wounding on ones? That's what it is. Wounding on ones. Well, All right. Is You've one got no rend on this, but it is two damage because you're a stupid skink. Mm. <laughs> they have four? I don't think they have four. They have six. Well, they can attack back. Are you done? That's the only. That's the only combat. So you've got six on there, including the uh, the alpha. Yeah, actually, you're at fourteen now. So yeah. Sad. More sad. Ah. I'm guessing they have no rend. Yep. Well, he only has a four-up save, so one damage is yeah. done to my chicken. Yeah. He's down to 13. That is it for combat, but we do have to roll for Battleshock. Saurus mm -hmm. and Skinks both have to roll. Skinks. Oh boy. Ooh, so that's a total of seven. What's their bravery? Five. The two run. <laughs> Saurus. Okay. Yeet. Three. That's five. I'm sure their bravery is five or higher. Yeah, that's eight. All right, go ahead and put those away. And now at the end of the round here though, I do control. What do you mean end of the round? I'm sorry, end of the turn. Four of the objectives. I'm in a bad spot. So, and I did barge. So I get the full five, finally. That's, that's the not first, good. That's the first turn I've gotten five points straight. That's not good. So we're going to go ahead and shuffle it on over. So you get, what do you want for your battle tactic? What do you want for your heroic? Well, I'm going to heal my Ogre. Yes! Heal one. Please move him up to six. Pretty pathetic, Ogre. Pretty pathetic. Do you want to do Desecrate? Yep. Stop desecrating my lands, Drake. No. They're beautiful lands. No, they aren't. Oh. Uh, let's go. Oh, what do you want to do for your heroic? Come here, point. Oh. No, Croak's best day ever. Croak's best day ever. Now let me see if my guys do anything. Croak, come here, points. Croak, give me zero. He's, th he's concentrating. Stink, command point. He gave me zero. Okay. All right, I think that takes you to spells. Spells. Uh, you got four from Croak and one from the- First, lasers. 
Ah, lasers. I right, choose this as my lasers, I get the buff. Oh yeah, you do. So on a, but it's only gonna hit the sky fires, but on a two up, you get them. One. I got it. I got them one. All right, well, dang. All right, now spells. Uh, comet spell. 11. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> no. Uh, it's more fate points, just let it happen. I don't need fate points anymore. Uh, oh, actually, I hit it with an 11, so that gives me a buff. If you have D6 units, you get to pick the comet skull. Uh, you yeah. know what, I'll roll, I'll roll the... You have to get a six. Well, you got it with an 11, right? Yes. So I'm gonna use that, those guys went on a 10. My 10 man unit, they're gonna try to unbind. All right, All right D6 units. I will be picking one. Oh, okay. That's not terrible. I pick your ogre. In the, okay, pick my ogre. So D three. I should. All right, pick. drop him back down to five. I will, yeah. Drake. What? Rally. Okay. At unit of three. Okay. That means I'm gonna roll seventeen dice, Drake. And they rally on a four up. All right, four up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, only seven come back. They're 10 man unit again. Only? Yeah, only. Only? Okay, Lord Croak did cast one spell. I've well, got, I'm I've still got casting. I've got a Volchark. I am, I am still. Volchark. All right, we're gonna keep track. He's taken one wound so far. All right, what do you want to cast for your second spell? Uh, Celestial Deliverance. All right, I got it with an eight. You got it with an eight. I will use my chicken to try to unbind. And by on 10. All right, doing it again. 13. <laughs> well, okay, I guess that one goes off. All right, uh, I pick up to three units. I pick them, them, and the guys who just rallied. No, stop it. All right, starting with the guys who just rallied. No. <sighs> Upward. No. Yeah, isn't it a two up? I thought it was a four up. I think it's a two up. Oh yeah, no two up. Yeah, so the first one was a one. Yeah. All right, so the ogre takes three. Oh. Is he a chaos demon? Not. Move him down to two, please. Dang! Stop killing my ogre. My ogre hasn't done anything all game. He's just, he's just been lazy. All right, now the sky fires. Please roll a one. I don't want to lose any more sky fires. You will be losing sky fires. Mm. You will be losing three. That kills one. Was he at three? Yeah. Ah. All right, casting it again. All right, now you need a nine. This is your last cast. Yes. You got it with a nine. Yes. I will try to unbind with the chicken. No. I'm bound on 12. Okay. Okay. You. Arcane Bolt. 10. All right, I'll try to unbind with my revived unit. I'm up. Ah, oh, okay. Time for... Movement. Movement. All right, we'll do a quick before and after. All right, uh, that means it's shooting time. You have one shooting attack. Get him, boy. Who's, who's he shooting into? Uh, uh, yeah, or... Oh, gosh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have to hit all of this. It's only one rend. It's three, three is one rend, one damage. I will, I will go ahead and all out. I want to save the ogre. I missed it. He's fine. All right. So it's one rend, you said? Yep. So he's back to his four up. He still took the damage. He's at one. All right, mark him down to one for me. And then, do you have any charges you want to charge? Yes. All right, who's charging? Uh, Croak. Man, Croak is like the combat veteran. He's in. <laughs> Dumb old flying Croak. <laughs> okay, Croak in his flyness <laughs> goes over there to my Ogroid. Okay, let's do this, boys. Let's go. Uh, I will go ahead and use my last command point for an all out. Wait, he has a rand, right? Yeah, yes. so I'll, I'll use my all out. You're making me waste command points. All right. All right, I will attack back. 
With my Ogroid. This isn't good. It's not gonna be that bad. This is round five, right? This is round four. Okay. Threes. And uh, threes. Oh gosh. Staff. Yeah. Threes. And threes. Okay, one rend on these. Okay. So this is D3 damage each, so you get two. Okay. And then hooves, I'm gonna just stamp, stamp, stamp it with my little hoovy feet. Oh, you can't even threes. reach me. Threes. Oh, I can reach. Well. Uh, threes. No rend on this. All right, I think you have to roll triple sixes. Yeah. What is that so possible? Okay. Oh. Oh, why didn't I have that when I did all that damage last time? Okay, so at the end of the battle round, you have met your battle tactic, and you control three. Three. Which is, oh, do you control? No, you only control two. I control that one still. Yeah. Uh, so you control two. That's still the same number of points because you have four points for that round, which means at the end of round five, round four, you're, end of round four, you are up by a point. What? Yeah, because I missed that battle tactic. Um, okay, this is it. Battle round five. Getting ugly out there. I really need a six here. If I lose it, it's over. It's gonna be a one. That was mine. That was mine. Let's trade. No. Nope. <laughs> So you want me to Double take it? Time! Uh, all right, so you get one command point. There it is. I'm going to get three. three. Oh, at the end of the turn, I have to do Battle Shock. I'm going to use my one so that I don't uh, fail it. And then let me see if I get I'll my, roll it for you. Let me see if I get it back. Oh, I do. And it becomes a? Zero. Five. That's pretty good. Turn that one into a five. I don't have any more good Battle Shock dice, but. <laughs> all right. Spells. Comets call. Comets call. Comets call. Why does it never work? Oh, whew. Sester Deliverance. All right. Seven, eight, nine. Get it with a nine. All right, I'm going to try to unbind with the chicky. Uh, it's 12. All right, casting it again. Get it with a 10. <laughs> I'm going to try to unbind with the chicky. No. Let me roll that unbind. Actually, that worked. No, I rolled a 10. Yeah, that would have been a 10, but I get plus one. Why? Because every demon within 12 inches of him gets plus one, including him. So that I rolled an 11. 10, 11, 12, you can't use your chicken. No, that's only 11. Yeah, but... My chicken already did these uh, two unbinds. All right, I'm you gonna have use, to use double six. No, because that's an 11. Okay. If I show an 11 with one of the guys, I get it. Oh, I thought for sure it was going to be there. All right, who's getting delivered? I, I get to pick three. Yes, you do. Him, him, and them. All right, oh, do great. the Ogroid first. Put me out of my misery. I did it. He's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Yes. All and right, Skyfire. E. Yes. For three. Oh, he's down to one. Ooh. That's ugly. Go put that one on him. Oh, I have to my Ogroid. And your those guys. All right, I did it for two. All right, so they have their shields. <laughs> one of which works. Go ahead and pull one off for me. <laughs> and I do get a fate point for a successful cast spell. He okay. is going to do Arcanic Bullstick. Try and kill that guy off. Okay. And we take the objective. Yep. Well, all you have to do is move Croak on, you don't take the check. Yeah, but I want to kill him. Nah, it depends on And that's it, that's all your spells. Now I have to go in and kill him. Oh, you got a laser. Oh yeah. That. Okay, on a two up. Let me kill him. Yeah. He's dead. Yes! Ah, my sky fires. All right, that object was mine. Now I, the reason I wanted to take that is now I can move Croak back onto this and continue that fight. Continue the fight. All right, it's no longer Croak's finest hour. Oh, did we do, we didn't do, uh... No. What do you want to do for your hook and what do you want to do for your battle tactic? Uh, command point. I did get it. 
Um, I'm gonna try to. Oh no, not gonna point. Sorry, I'm gonna try and heal my stick. This is at four. Oh, okay. Yep. And I am going to go for a command point. Okay. Nope. Ha! <laughs> you don't have a general. You have a general. I do have a general still. Okay. All right. So with that, Adelaide, so... what did you pick for your battle tactic? All right, gaining momentum. All right. So Drake says you're gaining momentum. You got to pick something to kill, and you have to have more objectives than I do. What's gonna die? This unit of nine. Nine, I feel like. All right. Mm. I don't like it, Drake. Okay. Like it. So uh, let's go ahead and do your movement phase. Okay, that is it. At the end of the movement phase, the sigil hits. We'll see if it kills any more Snorris. It kills. No more Snorris. Oh, I shouldn't move the Snorris to stop your chicken. Oh, do you want to move him real fast? Okay, so with the Snorris moved, it is now charge time for the charge slime. All right, I really need these. This objective is mine now. I will be at the end of the turn, yeah. Oh, if the skinks leave, it won't be mine anymore. Correct, you check at the end of the turn. Yeah, so the skinks are going to have to they stay have there. They have to stay. So this guy has to deal nine damage on his own. Oh, shooting fish. He gets to zap him. Okay, give him a zap. I will all out, since I know you have to kill them, I'm going to all out defense. Ooh. Oh. One ren, right? Yep. So they're back to their fives. Oh. They're sixes. We killed one. They're no longer the a wizard. The problem is, every time I kill one of them, I'm losing an attack from Croak. Because Croak has to land a perfect score to kill them all. All right. Uh, now charges. I think I'm going to have to charge the stinks. Because Croak has to land a perfect kill with zero saves on your part. All right. This, I'm going to have to put the skinks in. All right, charge skinks. Uh, we'll charge in Croak first. No, did the skinks run? No, they didn't run. No. All right, croak first. He's in. <sighs> croak is in. All right, and stinks. Six. All right, so let's turn to combat. Who's going to combat first? I'm going to have Lord Stoke combat first. Do it up. All right, there so are... Well, it's within three inches of him, so you might have to pile him in just a little bit. So he's like in the middle. Oh, good enough. There you go. Now you got eight attacks. All right. Let's see if we can I'm land. All at defense again. We have to land. We have to land a perfect strike on with Croak. Okay. See, I wouldn't got my tactic right there. Okay. Wounding on. Three. See, I would also would have not have gotten. Them. I had to bring the skin. Uh, what's in. the rend? The rend is uh, one. Fives. Oh no. One damage? One. Ugh, oh, kills off a dude. Ah, uh, Stinks are gonna have to deal seven damage. That's highly improbable. I might not get my tactic, because my tactic was- Yeah, you might not get your tactic on this one. That it will be very bad. One, Do you want to leave your Stinks back? 11, 12, 13, 14. Yeah, it wouldn't matter. Yeah, I'll leave him back. All right, so you have like one Skink that can attack. Oh, that's not good. Go ahead and attack with a one skink. Maybe he'll do something. Oh, he's trying. Is three's wound? Nope. Oh. All right. All right. All eight of my guys are going to attack Croak. We're going to make this happen. Well. Okay. I so, have four, though. The three glaives. We'll attack into Croak. Hitting on fours. Wounding on threes. One wound. One rend on this. Okay. So that's two damage, plus I have uh, five normies. Fours. And threes. Nothing. Surprisingly, Lord Croak hasn't croaked yet. Yep, well, with two damage, he's not gonna. So. That is it for the round. Now, at the end of the round, you control. You did not make your battle tactic, but you do get three points for the round. So I'm up by four. You have, you get 20. You have 16. And I'm at 16. So I need four points. It's tie. On my turn, these guys so that's can one, move to there. Two. And I'll desecrate that's and 16. I'll have those two. Oh, wait. Then the... Chicken is gonna flap over. 
can go, if I auto run, 18. you can go 18, which I think. Oh, I think that's game. Will get me to the very edge. Game. So I can get five points, which means. It's game. That is game. That was a close game. All right. What'd you think of this one, Drake? I liked it. I don't, I don't like that it splits like this. Yeah. I don't I, like games like that. I, yeah, the. The short table edges I'm not as big a fan of, but it was still pretty good. I thought we had some great back and forth. Croak was like MVP. Yeah. Just crushing it. His comments call went off never. It went off once. It barely did anything. But this was pretty good. This, uh, I, what do you think of the battle plan with the extra rallies? Me. No, I thought it was pretty cool. I, you got back seven of these guys. I, I got back like seven of those guys. Mm. You got back a Croxagore. Yeah. I thought it was pretty cool. You lasered me a hundred times. The lasers Those lasers are so good. Yeah, I thought this was pretty good. I had a good time. You had a good time with this one? Yeah. Good. All right, well, uh, this is a fun one. I think I'm going to put this in my, like, maybe top tier, maybe mid tier of uh, yeah. battle plans we like. So do we have worst ones yet? I don't think we've played any that I hated. But uh, we'll we'll come back to that. Anyway, this has been another episode of Battle Ready. Thanks so much for watching.